ensure you are paid for your aid in keeping my rift open, and to ensure you see that I am willing to help your cause. Paid how? I have found new code which allows you to change the element of one of your powers. You have a place I can test this? Indeed I do. In order to use this element, you will need to manually alter your power. Manually? Yes. I have created this tutorial message to explain how to do so. Oh, well, that's handy. Now use your fire blast on those people. It will ignite anyone in the blast radius. <laughs> okay, this would be great at a barbecue. More element types exist in this simulation for various powers, if you are able to find or create the code that is. Thanks for the help. It is not help, only repaying my debt. Now I will let you continue on your quest to find me the body you promised. I won't help me break into other simulations unless he gets a body. So how do we get him one, Kenzie? The Zen have almost everything in the simulation locked tight, but there is something you can use. A control and interface device. Hey, great. Where do I find one? You're in luck. The Zen have a bunch in transit right now. Is anyone counting these kills? <laughs> Wait to taste or something. The Zen are 
are using CIDs to bring a downed hotspot online. Once you have a CID from them, get it to a safe spot and wipe its old programming so the AI can upload its personality into the new shell. Go back to that first hotspot you took down. You can get a CID there. Simple smash and grab, huh? Sure. Go with that. Just get one and take it to the safe spot. You don't want to deal with Zin while trying to hack that device. Curious, is there any way to get this AI a body in the real world, too? At this point, the AI is purely information. He's entirely digital. You could download him to your phone if you wanted. Why? Does he want a body? Would you want to be stuck inside the simulation forever? Good point. Check the ship for a suitable shell just in case. Along with the CIDs, Zen are transporting a prototype for a contained force recursive feedback projector. Kenzie, that sounds like complete bullshit, even coming from you. <sighs> Imagine a gun that fires a bullet that bounces from one target to another to another to another like a pinball racking up a billion points. Oh. Careful not to damage all the CIDs. I don't know when or if we'll get another chance to get one of these. Yeah, 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 Kenzie, I got this. That's why I get paid the big bucks. Which CID should I grab? It doesn't matter, just pick one. Ow! Shit! What did you do? I touched it! Well, touch it different next time. What the hell, Kenzie? Don't pin this on me. These things are broken. Don't you blow up on me. Yes! Finally. Quick, get to a safe spot so you can crack it open. How far away do I need to be? Just away from the Zin. Pick some place they won't find you. How long is this whole thing gonna take? I won't know until I crack open the device and see how it ticks. All right, this spot looks good. Keep an eye out while I work on this. I guarantee the Zin have a way of finding these devices remotely. Shit, they found us. Don't let them take the CID. Work fast. Done yet? Would you like to take over? I could shoot aliens for a while. Point. Kenzie, where are we at on this? Almost done. Little bit more. Okay, the CID is cracked and clear for uploading. I'm putting the AI code now. Great. How long until the upload is completed? 55 minutes. F 55 minutes? 
These things usually take like three to five tops. Look, the connection in this area is slow. Get closer to a major connection point like a power plant and this might go faster. Why didn't we go there first? Because a major connection point for the simulation is going to be heavily guarded. We'll sit down, load faster? Well, probably, but... And we're taking this thing there. Once Sid's up and running, how long until we can use him to get my crew? Well, assuming the AI wasn't lying, I don't see a reason why we shouldn't be able to get right to it. Speaking of which, who do you want to grab first? Pierce? Shondi? I, uh... I think we should get Matt. Miller? Oh my god, why? Hey, Matt turned himself around at the steel port. He joined MI6, helped us with Cyrus Temple, and... You know, he's... Useful. Ish. Useful? You have a lot on your plate, Kinsey, with all this... Cyber, what's it? Figured you could use the help. I'm doing just fine without Matt Miller. Thank you. Two heads are better than one, Kinsey. Set it up. All right! I'm here. I just need to clear these Zen out first. Still standing! Switch and done. Excellent. How long now? Uh, Kenzie? That's just part of the process. Apparently the sweary part of the process. The full download should only take about 16 minutes. Is there anything you can do to make it go faster? I'll see what I can find. There might be additional access points we can use to increase the bandwidth. Close. Personality transfer at 31%. I found an access point that can help speed this along. Get to it and activate it. Found it. Second one. I'm still standing. Ooh. 
All right, both the access points are online. How's the download looking? Much faster. Much, much too fast. Too fast. Sid is overloading. Overloading? Overheating. Get to him and cool him down. Woohoo! to throttle the connection a bit, so it should be much more stable now. How long until the download's done? Three minutes. Good. So give me just enough time to fight up a few waves of Zen. Where did these murder bots come from? Murder bots? How? Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm having a bit of a stronger reaction. one of these murder bots instead. Do you really want to give some rogue AI an exoskeleton equipped with a complement of weapons and a history of violence? Probably not. And besides, I already found a real CIG body for him on the ship. So, you know, synchronicity. Why does this hurt so much? Personality transfer at 74%. Data bottleneck encountered. to kill us some aliens. Oh, God. I'm gonna regret getting Sid a real body, aren't I? Oh, Sid. Shit. This is great. Uh, Kenzie? Take him down and I should be able to transfer some of his powers to you. Whoa, this is... Why is my brain on fire? Welcome to being able to move things with your mind. There's a 
a giant glass orb here, Kinsey. Yeah. It has more clusters in it. Pick it up with your mind and smash it open. Okay, now use that power to throw things at the warden and take down his shields. I'm sure you'll have plenty of chances to use it. contains a variety of floating rings. The color of the ring denotes the type of object you need to throw it through in order to score a point. Vehicles go through blue, people through green, and the head of our very own Professor Genki through the pink ones. Score a point on every hoop within the time limit, and you win. Good, Good luck. luck. It's murder time, fun time. to Professor Genki's Mind Over Murder! Brought to you in part by everybody's favorite alien overlord, Xinyak! That's right, folks. The maven of mascot mayhem has teamed up with the conqueror of countless galaxies to create an all-new Genki experience. As folks at home know, by exploiting weaknesses in Zinyak's meticulously crafted simulation, our contestant has gained the power of telekinesis. But they will have to master the power of the mind to complete the challenges ahead of them today. I can now see why the professor was so eager to join forces with Zinyak. This should make for an interesting addition to the Genki family of games. Right you are, Bobby. So let's meet our contestant, the winner of Genki Bowl 7, and our favorite contestant, the President of the United States. Or whatever bits are still floating around in space, right, Zach? <laughs> too soon, Bobby. Too soon. Let's get to the action. And that's it for our first match. Excellent job by our contestant.
All right, we got Sid. So, how do we use him to get Matt? Um, are you really sure about this? I mean, I know he can help, but it's Matt Miller. Kenzie, if he can help us find the others, then yes, I'm certain. Now, how does this work? Well, I give Sid the proper cipher to connect to Matt's personal simulation, and he opens the gateway. All right, let's go get the kid, then. I was shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's only vaguely insulting. Look, you sound just like Julius Little. Putting a guy who betrayed you in the number two slot seems like a great way to get killed. I'm nothing like Julius. Kenzie, we're ready. I'm sending Sid the jailbreak. Any last advice? When you're inside Matt's virtual oubliette, there's a decent chance that I'll be focusing on interfacing with the intrusion countermeasures, so pay attention to the console commands. Any last advice I'll understand? Don't get killed. Gotcha. self-proclaimed hacker guy. Ran all the cyber terrorism for the syndicate back in Steelport. Now he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. Just so we can trust him like she does. Hey, Kenzie, how am I supposed to rescue Matt without a weapon? Well, you don't have superpowers either. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why the fuck are there giant words in my face? It's a command prompt. Just give me a second. Again. Damn it! The camera screwed up. I just have to deal with it. <gasps> this ain't my first time at the top-down tank rodeo. Kenzie, you gonna fix this or what? I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. That's why I get paid the big bucks. Could it be as simple as? 3D? No, 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 don't put in a space. Oops, sorry, finger slipped. Finally. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. And I just blow this thing up, right? Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. I must say, I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> Actually, twice. No, three times. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. Well, what do you care if I try? Uh, very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. Lots of firepower here, Kinsey. Destroying the tower should destroy the tanks with it. Miss Kensington is rather astute for a human. 
Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Oh, That's two. One more to go. Oh, wanted to thank you, by the way, Kinsey. For what? Well, I'm in cyberspace and I haven't been turned into a sex doll or a toilet yet. God, are you still mad about that? I said I was sorry. Something kind of sticks with you in your nightmares. All right, last tower's going down. Oh, I don't think it should be that easy for you. He's made the tower invulnerable. Hang on, I'll find a way. All oh, hail the me! Impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh, look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the zigzag, my dear. Tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. To the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays have lighted fools the way to dusty death. Out, out, brief candle. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage. And then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot. Full of sound and fury. Sit the time. <laughs> What idiot said that? It's a quote from Macbeth. And it's like that. Getting him out without any weapons or a key? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. He'll just have to wing it. Normally you yell at me when I wing it. Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. You just keep those reassurances coming. Z, what's going on? Before you, I place a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live on borrowed time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you would willingly submit yourself to execution. This is the moment where you can prove to be the savior of humanity, or its absolute destroyer. What the hell is all this? This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes, and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. 
Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. The evidence is irrefutable. How many have died because you decided that driving on the sidewalk is faster than the road? Because you used a rocket in place of a bullet. Because you wouldn't submit to my rule. In the end, you only hurt those you are trying to protect. In the end, there is only one truth. The human race would be much safer without you in it. What the hell is all this? This is your life as it led you. Childhood. Wait, is that mad? Trapped in technology he doesn't understand, in a cyber world he can't control. Don't worry, Matt. I'll get you out. Without Miss Kensington. Very doubtful. Behold my empire. Not very big. This is but a glimpse of what I have conquered. Oh, is this the island that pirate came from? Must you continue to display your plebeian intelligence? Ooh, guess I'm hitting a nerve. I tire of this. Deal with her on your own. Ta-ta. Deal with who? don't like the idea of us sitting around. Shouldn't we be picking up Matt? The kid could be in trouble. Keith, you gotta relax. The guy's an MI6 agent, for God's sake. He can take care of himself. You needed help getting out, and you're the commander-in-chief. That's a really good point. Why didn't we think of this earlier? Oh, I did. I'm just not a big fan of Matt. Kinsey! Come on! Can't I get some payback? Got a little lost, big deal. Or he got a little dead, who knows? Oh, he's fine. He's probably having the time of his life exploring Zinyak's ship. Every store you hack feeds me security data. I can use that data to insert a virus, which will open up a doorway back to the ship. So go hack while I work on the virus. Got it.
Alright, let's try a friendly fire. Seems these are linked to a lot of weak areas in the simulation. Same grid. Hack it, and I won't judge you if you want to do a little shopping while you're there. enough for a new doorway. I'm sure there will be lots of defenses thrown at you, so defend the area while everything gets uploaded.
so close. Looks like it all worked. Stop by the ship and we'll see about that doorway. Good news, I was able to open the door in the southwest of the city. Turns out this method is really useful. Think you can keep going with it? If it works, sure thing. Thank <laughs> you. 